The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is from the second letter of the Apostle Paul to the Corinthians. But remember, anyone who sows sparsely will reap sparsely as well, and anyone who sows generously will reap generously as well. Each one should give as much as he has decided on his own initiative, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. God is perfectly able to enrich you with every grace so that you always have enough for every conceivable need and your resources overflow in all kinds of good work. As scripture says, to the needy he gave without stint, his uprightness stands firm forever. The one who so freely provides seed for the sower and food to eat will provide you with ample store of seed for sowing and make the harvest of your uprightness a bigger one. And our response is from Psalm 112. Alleluia. How blessed is anyone who fears Yahweh, who delights in his commandments. His descendants shall be powerful on earth. The race of the honest shall receive blessings. All goes well for one who lends generously, who is honest in all his dealing. For all time to come, he will not stumble. For all time to come, the upright will be remembered. Bad news holds no fears for him, firm in his heart, trusting in Yahweh. His heart held steady, he has no fears, till he can gloat over his enemies. To the needy he gives without stint, his uprightness stands firm forever, his reputation is founded on strength. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. Jesus said, In all truth I tell you, unless a wheat grain falls into the earth and dies, it remains only a single grain. But if it dies, it yields a rich harvest. Anyone who loves his life loses it. Anyone who hates his life in this world will keep it for eternal life. Whoever serves me must follow me, and my servant will be with me wherever I am. If anyone serves me, my Father will honor him. The Gospel of the Lord.